Twas the night before Christmas when all through the house, not a creature was stirring except maybe a computer mouse. I think Santa it tries to keep his, uh, his operations top secret. For decades, Santa sleuths, even the military, have been trying to spot the sleigh in real time. Hello, this is Norad Track Santa. Can I help you? Norad has been tracking Santa since 1955. Back then, you had to call a hotline and volunteers on the other end would tell you St. Nick's whereabouts. Since then, the technology improved to a two-dimensional map on a website. Obviously not as immersive as a 3D globe. And that is where a tech company called Cesium at 4th and Market was called in to help. We received updates from their sensors about where Santa's location is on Christmas Eve as he's making his trips around the Earth. Um, and we take that data and position a 3D model of Santa um, on the virtual globe. That model, which launched 10 years ago, is now viewed by millions of kids and kids at heart on Christmas Eve, watching whimsically as Santa slips from town to town. We're able to move Santa's 3D model so that it's over the correct location. No easy feat, but probably easier than dropping off gifts to the whole world in 24 hours. A lot of people are depending on. Yeah, I mean, it's kind of scary. We don't want our app to break at all. We don't want to. We don't want to make any changes to the code right before Christmas and, and crash the app because that would be pretty disappointing to the millions of people who use it. There are plenty of Santa's helpers at NORAD and yes, here in Philly, all who exclaim as he drives out of sight. I'm excited to think that like my my lines of code can bring so much joy to families across the world. A Merry Christmas to all and to all a good night. In Old City, Matt Delucia, NBC 10 News.